21st Century Entrepreneurship with Martin Piskarik. You never know when you can be a person with disabilities. You need to change the world now when uh, you can change the world. Because when you come to be a person with disability, then it's too late. Also, it's our duty to live in the place where uh, the, every human being have uh, the right to, to live, to work, to be as much as dependent as they can. So to live, to work, to be independent. Let's go to the beginning of the story and what are we talking about? UNO is an NGO. Uh, it started 15 years ago. We start uh, first with the children with a disability. After that, we start, uh, we continue work with adult people with disability and also uh, children with disability who is uh, with, uh, uh, without parents. Um, after that, we uh, get together people from the gastronomy sector. Uh, for, from hospitality sector, it is uh, the bartenders, sommeliers, uh, uh, cooks, uh, chefs, uh, etc. And uh, also uh, we do the gala dinner, uh, where we get together people, uh, professional people, with the people with disability, where they can work together, uh, learn uh, about. Uh, uh, the 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 possibility of uh, the the persons who, which uh, who they work with and uh, together they produce uh, beautiful uh, things and what is the most beautiful thing uh, in the world is uh, to prepare some some dish where can they sit together uh, they can enjoy eating this the, uh, this meal they prepare or this drink and also they can offer the what they prepare to the people who came and to see uh, the possibility of the people with uh, different kind of uh, disability And you came to original, to original idea. I, I never saw it in any part of the world. I don't know. Maybe, I, maybe I'm the only one, but I'm not sure. I think that it's very original. It's a, it's brand new. So in the last four and a half months, we start uh, to organize the first European competition for people with disability. Uh, the first uh, country was the Cyper. And now it's 19 country in uh, four, in so in only four months and one week, and uh, hopefully we will uh, have uh, a six more country, and then uh, we will bring from each country the most capable person uh, in preparing the food and drink to come to Zagreb and they will have the professional chefs and the professional bartenders who, who, they, who will teach them how to prepare the food. Uh, together they will, they will prepare the food and uh, this will be the competition. We will invite the very famous people who will come, uh, watch them. After that, they will, eat, they will eat this food. And uh, the food and the drink is the key of uh, changing the uh, people's minds because uh, you can never forget uh, this event. Because when you when you see somebody with disability, how they're maybe drawing something, you saw that, but uh, after that, after several years, you can forget it. 
but when you eat the food, then it, sta uh, it stays memorized for the rest of your life. So maybe, maybe today you will not be able to help uh, how to change uh, the, uh, the environment where you are working, but maybe in one or two years, when you remember again this uh, food that you eat on this uh, competition, you will say in your um, uh, ministry or you can say in your work, in your workplace, I want persons with disability to be the part of uh, my environment and I want that you hire somebody who is with disability. So I believe in the future which comes uh, in the years which comes we can uh, change the environment because people with disability need to be visible every day not just uh, one day per year when we celebrate something no because this is the person who lives uh, every day like we are so we need to see them in the bars in the restaurant in the hotels uh, they need to work in the banks in the post office we need to see them every day they need to be the part of uh, the regular labor market Any specific project aspects you are satisfied with and uh, some of them that you are not, not satisfied? We are happy with, with the people with disability, how they react on this competition. But uh, what we are not happy, we are not happy because uh, in this uh, 18 country, I don't see people with the disability, uh, they are working in these hotels, in, in restaurants. I see they are still in some uh, places where is people with disability. No, it's not a good message. I want to see one person, for example, in Redison Hotel who is in the reception. I want to see one person who is in Redison Hotel who is on, uh, in the bar or in the kitchen. It, it can be any other hotel or any other camp or, or, or some, some industry where people with disability are visible. I don't see them on these regular places where all the people goes, you know. So if you want to see people with disability, you need to go in the specific place where people with disability are working. This is not the message that I want to send uh, to me because tomorrow I can be a person with disability or maybe to my children because tomorrow they can be some persons with disability or grandchildren, you know. I want to, for them to be in regular places, Redison. Uh, Hilton, uh, um, any other company who is uh, open to uh, really do the inclusion. Not to speak that they are doing inclusion, no, they need to do that. So I hope this competition will open the eyes for some company, camp companies who will say, yes, we want to hire people with disability uh, in our place. And how can we help you? How can we support you? Maybe the, the best support is uh, that some camp company see what we are doing and say, this is a good for, uh, for our business model because uh, we want to include people with disability. We want to have a contract with you. We will hire uh, every year the best competitor from each country and we will offer him a job in our company because, for example, in this 18 country, I see in each country Radisson hotels. So they can hire somebody who is the winner from each country. It doesn't matter is it Estonia or Denmark, Sweden or, 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 or Croatia, or it doesn't matter. So for them, it is very good because they show that they uh, they care about the people and also it's a good motivation for people with disability to say i want to join this competition because somebody will see me somebody will see how capable i am 
because I want to work. I don't want to work only where is the people with disability. No, I want to work where is the you know, everybody, people with and without disability. I hope that you will see this competition uh, very useful for uh, this world. And I invite everybody to follow us. You can follow on YouTube channel Cupid Spoon, or you can see all the information on www.uno.hr. It's, uh, it's up to you. Close your eyes, try to, to think that sometimes you can be a person's visibility and what you can do today, don't wait tomorrow. 21st Century Entrepreneurship with Martin Piskarik. Imagine a space where triumphs, trials, and tales of entrepreneurship come alive. Welcome to the 21st Century Entrepreneurship Podcast, a gold awarded journey hosted by Martin Piskorik, connecting with listeners in 95 countries and ranking in the top 0.5% of all podcasts. Join our exclusive community, elevate your perspective, and embark on the path to success.